third game has commenced. It's one game apiece between these veterans' dog. Yes, and I can see that Emmanuel has maintained the template he had from the second game to attack early and to attack fast and hard. That was a typical example of what Vampy does. He served with the anti, and you see that the reception of Emmanuel went very high. And he does so well to flip in between the anti and then the smooth rubber. It's three points to one, Emmanuel serves. A lovely one attack from Emmanuel. Certainly, certainly. Lovely ball. A very fast one. Fast, fast and attack. Good toss spin from Van Peel. It's two points to four, he serves. In this third game, a good serve once again from Van Peel. Three points to four, he serves. Emmanuel needs to keep an eye on those rabbits. He needs to keep an eye on those rabbits. It looks as if Van P is unable to play a second ball when he attacks. And Emmanuel is capitalizing. Emmanuel is blocking well and he says at six points to three. I think that was a wonderful observation from you, Fifi. It was very clear in the second game as well. That each time he plays the stop screen, once you block it, he's not able to counter. Exactly. Four points to seven. Van P serves. Lovely toss spin from Van P. Seven five. Emmanuel to serve. I like him from peace talks into a suicide mission. It's a do or die. Exactly. When you return it, he's unable to do anything. That was a nice chop from the ante. And once again, Emmanuel is not reading the rabbits. He's not that reading is. the rabbits. That was an error from him. Once he again. with a pimple again. <laughs> Emmanuel <laughs> needs to keep an eye on You will see clearly that. You can see clearly that it's out of source any time the pimple is used. Here we go again. <laughs> My word. Will Emmanuel learn, Fifi? I hope so. Else Van P is going to show him that you grow corn during the rainy season. Seven points to nine, he says, in this third game. This time the pimple goes against Van P. Exactly. It was a long serve. Van P serves for the third game. Is he going to use the pimple for this serve? I bet so. Lovely cross game. Lovely cross game from Van P. Don't grab the match on our hands. We start to let you. And the atmosphere is charged in the auditorium. The atmosphere is charged. We are in for That is Emmanuel that I tell for you. He's wondering what has hit him. He's wondering what has hit him. My goodness, Vampy reminds me of a man who has risen from the dead and is coming back. He has everything to look forward to. A good man to witness. Exactly, you can see that the fire crew are now coaching Emmanuel Daite. He is in a match indeed. He's a young veteran against a seasoned veteran. Who wins this encounter? Will it be the young man? Oh. The good old fox in Vampire. Dog, we live to see. We live to see. Stay tuned for the next match. Certainly. The fourth game has commenced between Van P and Emmanuel Daite. This is the semi final encounter of the first ranking tournament in the veterans. It's one point to all. One point all. The defending champion is having it very, very difficult in this encounter. There's fire in the fire camp. They are trying to decode the royal baby. Exactly. You need to quench it with some cold water. You need to get some cold water. Not just any water. You need some cold water to quench the fire. That uh, should be able to read when the pimple is used and when not it is used in order to have a chance in this encounter. One, two, he says. It's a push too long from the royal baby. Emmanuel needs to avoid those people. It's a good serve once again from the royal baby. Who is capitalizing on his serve and playing beautifully. My word! My 
The Royal Baby. There's confusion in that fire camp. If you can zoom in on to them there, you see that there's confusion there. Exactly. They don't know what to do. They don't know what is hitting them. The Royal Baby combines the pimple and uh, the smooth rubber beautifully. Although it's a pen player, it does combine it beautifully. Two points to four, that is serves. Another touchdown from the Royal Baby. Another touchdown from the Royal Baby. The defending champion is not on confidence. His body language is not great. It's called for a timeout, Doc. It's called for a timeout. I'm telling you, V, there's fire in the firehouse. There's fire in the firehouse. Let me take it. There we have it. We need some fire tenders. Exactly, we need some fire tenders. Not just fire tenders, but brand new fire tenders. Brand new fire tenders. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. The fourth game has commenced. We are back from the break. Two points to five. That is us. Five points to three. The Royal Baby, a.k.a. Van to serve. And he does it again. It looks as if nothing has really changed. Uh. Lovely to spin. From Emmanuel Dike, a.k.a. Samson up. He serves at four points to six. That's an edge ball. That's an edge ball. The Royal Baby is confronting the whole coaching team. Exactly. Of the He's making a statement here. He's that making a right in the face. Yes, that today is my day. Four points to seven. Man of the A very, very deep drop from the Royal Baby. Very deep drop from the Royal Baby. This is a historic match, too. Yes. When you know Emmanuel very well, you know that he's the kind of player who doesn't like deep chops. He prefers long rallies. And as such, the game style of Royal Baby is proven to be problematic for him, dog. This is an entertaining match by our standard. The atmosphere is exciting. It's a sharp contrast between the tension by the board and the excitement in the room. And he does it again. He Nine points. Four, he said. With the fireman land. Nine points to four. With the fireman land. It may be too late for him to learn. It may be too late. The royal baby is two points out. And he does it again. He does it again. What a confident player. What a confident player. Four points to ten. Emmanuel to seven. It looks like your thumb down has been betrayed. Can he conjure some magic? He might not to serve for his life. And it's all over. 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 The fireman has been quenched. It's all over. The fireman has been quenched. And there's excitement in the room. We are due to have a new champion. The fire has been quenched. It's exciting. I we witness the final. This was a semi-final encounter. This is certainly the finals before the final. The fireman has been quenched. And he's done and dusted. He's wondering what has really, really happened to him. It wasn't expected. This was a match in which he was to win, hands down. However, he has been silenced. He has been silenced. Doc, we wish our viewers farewell. We thank them for watching this match with us. What are your parting words, Doc? It is never too late to stomp back in the tournament. The Royal Baby had to come through to the, the knockout stages. By the scrap of his team, but there he is in the finals. A lesson for all. Never give up. Never give up. Thank you for watching.
My name is Lord Kenfo, and I'm here with Dr. Adela Josie. Bye-bye.